stars that glow from pole to pole. Interesting song. Thanks! Human prisoner used to sing. I thought maybe practice, sing with him. But then he was in corpse pile, so no singing with him. Happy to sing to you, though. Jewel him dama, fell the dumb. They're all the same. Nothing more than power hungry despots talking like that might get you gutted around here. Then my point is proven. They rule by fear. Even just rulers have their limits. Salinian. He was a true leader. Who? Salinian. The true hand, blessed by the forerunners. He moved against Indama and sought to unite us under a single leader. And since I have never heard of this Nishum, I assume he failed. All I am saying, brother, is that we must not follow simply because we are told to. You talk of following like a lonely grunt. We are at war, fool. Orders are orders. Act like you understand that. The Arbiter is a soldier just like you. He is not perfect. He is wise and brave. That is more than I can say for you. Now this is a good day for Sanghelios, brother. Yes. What is it? I hear worry in your voice. You should rejoice! What will happen when the Guardian will leave? Nothing will happen. Do not believe the stories you have heard. It is not a deity. It is barely a spaceship. Ungoian fusions are almost gone! Wait! Ungoian fusions are almost gone?! Received. Science human says to leave her alone! Understood. Science human needs a fusion core to calibrate something! Confirmed. Science human complains a lot! Good. Supply says rations will be late! Again! Confirmed. I think someone stole Science human's arm. Affirmative. What is it? Why do you pause? This wound is familiar. And Dama Keep. Their plasma blades burn less intensely, harder to cut armor, but the injuries are more grievous and do not cauterize. So the blades leave Sanghili alive, but too wounded to fight. Most choose suicide to preserve their honor, making any wound a death blow. Barbaric, indeed. Had I ever met Jewel and Dama, I would have gutted him with my bare claws. Touch me, you honorless filth! Had the Arbiter himself not ordered me here, I... We can ill afford to lose warriors, even those as inconsequential as yourself. You spill blood outside of battle! I would rather take my own life than let you touch me. That life is not yours to take. You belong to the Arbiter, and he believes you are worth repairing. I refuse to be shamed by a... <laughs> Medic. Then die, coward. Fail the Arbiter, and have the shame of your dereliction follow your clan for generations. I... Oh. Good. Since you cannot be brave, at least be quiet. There is no honor in dying in a tent, Medic. The Sanghili must fall. In battle! There is no battlefield harsher than a medic tent. Are you mad? You know nothing of combat! You fool. When I draw my weapons, it is for combat with death herself. I defend you with knife and needle. Uh, I fear no enemy. Not even death! Yes, that is what they always say. The Arbiter anticipates heavy resistance from Sunion. We will be prepared. When we have multiple patients, who do we treat first? Begin with whoever holds the highest rank. Brother, if we treat by rank, lives will be needlessly lost. Listen well. I once witnessed a surgeon treating a grunt's punctured lung when a commander arrived with a broken leg. And he demanded treatment before the grunt. The commander waited for a moment then limped to the operating table and snapped the surgeon's neck. By killing the surgeon, the commander endangered his troops. With no medical staff, by returning commanders to the front lines, we avoid further casualties. Mainly our own. Call it cowardice if you will. But if we are dead, brother, who would care for the wounded? 
We have traded our honor in battle for a chance to save lives. Cowardice is far from either of us, brother. Our systems have been compromised. By the human AI, not the Covenant. It is sabotage! We must respond! We fight one enemy at a time. Today, the Covenant. Today, the Covenant spine will be broken. It is a glorious day for the Sanhili. You will have humanity's best beside you. Our airstrikes will drive them out of hiding and into our ground troops. We clear and hold the indicated zone. We have sufficient military strength to handle the Covenant defenses. If the human plan holds, they will awaken the Guardian. And then Sunayan is ours. Everything is prepared. We will begin when the Constructor is ready. Dr. Halsey said the calibration could take days. Then we will begin without it. I have waited too long to let this opportunity pass. What did you think of our Sunayan attack heading alterations? It is not the kind of plan I would expect from a human. You suggest flying low and close to structures. Well, are you saying your pilots aren't up to the challenge? I am moments from a decisive victory for my own planet, Commander Palmer. Do not try to goad me. Arbiter, you know I do not follow the old ways. But to allow a human to awaken the Guardian... That discomfort you feel, that betrayal, I am depending on it. Sir? The Covenant soldiers will hear the Guardian wake from its slumber. They will look up over the bodies of their brothers through the smoke of their burning city. They will look to the horizon as their holy idol rises from the sea and forsakes them. And that is when the Covenant dies.